I love the peace and I love the war, war, war. I love the peace and I love the war, war, war. I love the peace and I love the war, war, war. I love the peace and I love the war, war, war. My name is Brian. My Korean name is Sungul. It means nine outstanding traits. Chun is the character for outstanding. Cool means nine. I was exposed to hip hop my junior year of high school. It was like the best thing that happened to me. I kind of became a fiend of that, just every night, just looking for new music. And naturally, I wanted to rap, start rapping at some point. I'm walking into Studio Chang. It's uh, Studio Chang, it's up in Duluth. My sound engineer, Sungo, he, he has his own little studio there. He was the first one to reach out to me in Atlanta about music first. I got top <laughs> We're just in the studio, just playing tracks, and he just does try some stuff on the on the vocals and on the beats. And sometimes I suggest some stuff, and you know we just we just we're just having fun. That's really what it is. But of course, ha having the goal in mind of really refining this song so it can be something great. So the atmosphere of the studio, it's kind of bland. Like there's no posters, there's no, there's nothing but work related things. And that's just the kind of guy Sumo is. So when I go into that room, I know the moment I sit down, we're gonna start working. It's like them raindrops in late spring. It comes pouring down on us, but soon it's all sunny, this fling. I'm sorry, but I don't love you no more, and I can't find no reason. It's like summer turn fall, like the leaves pop the trees in new seasons. Really believe that when a project is out, that in itself already is time. When you look at the art, work of art, song, painting, poem, you have to be able to feel the amount of time that has been poured into this. Right now, at this point of my life, I think I'm just doing everything that I want to do. And both school and music is something, both are things that I want to do. Like, I, I really enjoy being at school. I'm a philosophy major. All the classes that I'm taking this semester are dope. I'm definitely learning and growing from them. And music, you know, it's something I love and it's something that I want to keep on pursuing after college. You know, I'm just, I'm just trying to do school and I'm just trying to do my work. You know, this, for me, this is work. It's not just art. And for me, learning philosophy, um, learning about philosophy, about these different theories and reading these great texts definitely shapes me. And my appreciation for good writing does show in my lyrics. You'll see me doing a spectrum of genres, but I'll never, never half-ass on the lyrics. So that's, yeah, it's all related. So I lived in a lot of different cities. I was actually born in Fairfax, Virginia, moved to Maryland at some point, I don't remember. And my family moved to Korea when I was around six, lived there for 10 years and uh, went to San Diego 2008, came out to Atlanta 2011. And you know, when I was in Korea, I was soaking up the vibes, I was there. I actually never even thought that I would come back. You know, that place definitely shaped me. You know, I came out to Emory 2011. Uh, Atlanta definitely influenced me a lot. Uh, just the way, just the, the way I walk, the 
the way I talk, the way I interact with people, the kind of music that I was exposed to, the kind of scenes that I was ex exposed to experiencing outside of Emory. And you know, just the sun, the sun, when it hits you in the summer, when you're in that humidity, when you hear all those shikatas screaming, that shapes your identity some, somewhat, yeah. San Diego, of course. Just the vibe, the weather for sure, the food, and that's where I learned my American identity. You know what I'm saying? That's when I really conjured up what it means to be Brian, you know? Because Chungu, I was my whole life. And Brian, this guy who was sleeping ever since he was six, he just woke up when he was 16. You know what I'm saying? So. I really had to figure out what it means to be Brian, and hip hop was something that helped me a lot in that process. And I'm very, very grateful for the culture, the, you know, everything about hip hop. I'm grateful for its impact that it had on me. Yeah, yeah. As we grow, we grow stronger Though we pretend to be stronger Deep inside we need a lover And we long for one another But you're cruel